What's up guys, it's Autobot Mike 18 here with another DVD review and unboxing video. And guys, in this video I'm going to review and unbox Rise of the Planet of the Apes on DVD. Um, this movie is actually fairly recent. It uh, just came out last summer, uh, back in early August I believe, so it's almost a year old. But um, still, great movie, Rise of the Planet of the Apes. But anyway, before I go any further in this review... I have someone that has to get a shout out because this, uh, this YouTube channel guessed correctly on the hints that I left for this review and unboxing of Rise of the Planet of the Apes and also for this review and unboxing for Saw. Um, so, congratulations to Optimus Prime is boss. Uh, you guessed correctly on my hints for these two reviews and unboxings. And you, um, everyone, check out Optimus Prime is boss's channel. Uh, his, I will leave a link to his channel in the description part of this video, and I must say this, that is a badass name for a YouTube channel, um, I really like that, but congratulations again to Optimus Prime's boss, and everyone remember, you guessed correctly on my hints for DVDs, reviews, and unboxings, or Blu-ray reviews and unboxings, you will get a shout out in that review and unboxing that you guessed correctly, anyway, um, I'm going to now review and unbox Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Uh, this is the DVD version with the wonderful slipcover. I mean, I really, really like this slipcover. Um, I mean, the, the front cover art is just really... I just really love it. Um, anyway, the side uh, is the... On the side is the title. That's where the title is located for this movie. It says Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Um... And there is a very nice picture of Caesar there, played by Andy Serkis. You know, Andy Serkis did all the movements for Caesar and um, all that. And Andy Serkis was great in this movie, let me say that. And I just love this badass-looking picture of Caesar. I love how this, how the, the slipcover feels. Um, it definitely has, it's not just a plain feeling. Um, I really love how the, the artwork on the slipcover of Caesar's face, how detailed that looks. Um, anyway... It says 20th Century Fox right up there. There's that logo. There's their logo, excuse me. It says Rise of the Planet of the Apes on the side. And they could not have uh, wrote it out like that. They had to write it the way they did. Rise and then of the Planet of the Apes. Because they wouldn't have had room because it's such a long title. But anyway, um, there's another nice picture of Caesar right there. It says DVD video. Take a look at the other slipcover, uh, the other side. It says 20th Century Fox, Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Literally the same thing picture of Caesar, and it's his DVD video. Now, if you take a look at the back, um, you get uh, two pictures from the movie. This is the back of the slipcover. It's a nice picture of James Franco and Caesar in the forest. Um, very nice. Here, you get three quotes as well. Electrifying, a combination of craft, entertainment, and sheer spectacle from Newsday. Um, from the Wall Street Journal, thrilling, takes top honors for, for spectacle. Um, and lastly, Astounding Triumph, the year's finest action movie from Time magazine. Um, and then here's a nice picture of the, the bridge scene in the end of the movie, and there's a helicopter flying right there. I really love what they did with this slipcover. Uh, anyway, let's take the slipcover off. Uh, one sec, guys, and there it is. There's the DVD without the slipcover. It literally is the same exact thing for the front side, that is. Uh, if you take a look at the, uh, the side... Uh, the 20th Century Fox logo is, uh, right there again. Rise of the Planet of the Apes, uh, picture of Caesar, um, DV video. Now, here's the only difference between the slipcover back and, um, this is, you know what, they are actually completely different. Um, you get this picture here, uh, that's an extra picture that you don't get here. And then you get the bridge scene, which is the same for both. And then this one gets four extra pictures. So that's kind of cool. But anyway, uh, there's the bio on Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Um, I'm not going to go ahead and read that. But anyway, um, I believe these are actually, yeah, these are the actually the same exact quotes that I just read to you on the back of this. Um, I don't know why they, they put the same ones. They should have put other ones, if there were any other ones to put on there. But uh, I guess they didn't want to. But anyway, um, I'm not going to read them again. Um, there's pictures from the movie, that's, uh, Caesar and one of those, uh, those, uh, scientists, um, there's, uh, James Franco and Frida Pinto in this movie, uh, there's, uh, the apes, and there's a nice picture of Caesar right there, 
Um, now the special features, the excuse me, the special features are really you're not gonna get a lot. You get deleted scenes, you get mythology of the apes, you get the genius of Andy Serkis who played Caesar, and then you get the actual trailer. So you only get really four special features, not a lot, but it's still you do get some, which is good. Um, now if you take a look inside, here is the Rise of the Planet of the Apes disc, um, and I believe that is the window that uh, Caesar drew in chalk um, in while he was in that. Um, that like zoo, um, yeah, uh, but anyway, very nice look at the disc, uh, look on the disc, um, but anyway, uh, there's Rise of the Planet of the Apes, uh, let me just quickly put on the slip cover, and I will give my rating of this movie, uh, to be honest, guys, I really had no complaints whatsoever with this movie at all, um, sorry about that, guys, it took me a while to get the slip cover on, um, I really didn't, um, so I'm gonna have to give this movie probably either a 9 or a 9.5 out of 10. I thought it was really good. I thought the, the, the visual effects were really good, um, on the apes. I mean, they real these apes really looked, like, lifelike. I mean, it, it was just so really amazing. I mean, I was really, you know, astonished by how, how good the visual effects looked on the apes. And, um, I thought that was just really amazing. But, um, and I, Andy Serkis, you know played, uh, he did the movements for King Kong, I believe, um, and he, you know, you know, he's playing Caesar, I mean, I, I really just love how, how they did that, um, and I, I really, I can't, you know what, I really can't think of any complaints for this movie, but I don't feel that it deserves a perfect 10, you know, there probably were some faults here and there, but all in all, this was a really good movie, um, and I can't wait for a sequel, because the way it ended, I mean, you, you know there has to be a sequel coming soon, um, and to be honest, guys, I haven't seen the Planet of the Apes movies. This is the only one I have seen. I know they've made, you know, Planet of the Apes, Return to the Planet of the Apes. I, I don't even know. Uh, this is the only one I have personally seen. Uh, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this DVD review and unboxing of Rise of the Planet of the Apes. Like I said, like a 9 or 9.5 out of 10 for this movie, in my opinion. Um, and again, guys, check out Optimus Prime is Boss's channel. Like I said, link in the description part of this video so you guys can click on it, check it out. And, um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for, um, my movie review, The Dark Knight Rises, coming soon. And also stay tuned for, uh, other DVD reviews, unboxings, Blu-ray reviews, and unboxings that I will put on my channel. Bye, guys.